Well, in that case, I guess I'll have a table for two. A table for two? Uh, it looks like it's gonna be about a 45 minute wait. 45 minutes? How many people are in there? Uh, just your parents. What, then how is it gonna be 45 minutes? Well, we only have one table. What? Okay, why don't I just sit at that table? You have like six chairs. Well, I don't want to mix up the parties. I'm going to get confused with the order. Well, how about I just eat in the living room then? Well, the living room is reserved for weddings and conferences. What? I can place a to-go order for you. No, it's fine. I'll wait. Okay, um, I guess you can wait right here at this corner right here. Th th this is the waiting area? Yeah, you can like uh, play with this light switch. Oh, that's fun. Yeah, so uh, I'll see you in about 45 minutes. Okay. Mm-mm, that was delicious. Mm-hmm, sure was, baby. Well, are you ready to bounce? Yeah, let's roll. I ain't bringing my wallet shit. All right, so how's the food tasting, guys? Uh, guys? What? They laughed at... Chef Baby! I knew we shouldn't have trusted him! I mean, them! Chef Baby! What is it, Junior? We have a code red! A code red? What's the code red? They left without paying! Wait, what? Go ahead and stop them then! They already left, Chef Pee Pee! Oh my god, Junior! If they don't pay us, then we can't make money! And if we can't make money, we can't keep this restaurant open! Okay, Chef Pee, I'll, I'll make sure the next table pays. I, I promise. Dude, you better make sure! Okay, well, I already have a table waiting, so hold on, let me go get them. Hurry up then! God! Alright, sir, your table's ready. Junior, I just saw my parents leave, and they were laughing about how they didn't pay. I know, they didn't pay. Uh, Alright, well, I guess I'm ready for some grub. Alright, come on. Alright, Cody, so thank you for choosing Bone Apple Titty. Um, I'd recommend the burnt mac and cheese. It's really, really good. It's a house favorite. So, uh, what would you like to start off with a drink? Oh, uh, I don't think I'll be having anything to drink. I think I have enough liquids in me after last night. <laughs> right, Ken? Up top! <laughs> but, but, but seriously, I, I'm fine. I don't need a drink. Uh, okay, uh, what would you like to eat? Um, I think me and Ken are gonna split the Alfredo. All right, uh, I'll put that order in, Cody. Okay. Thank you. All right, Chef PB, I need an order of Alfredo. All right, Junior, but make sure that person doesn't leave, okay? It's Chef PB, it's Cody. He's not gonna leave. He's my best friend. I trust him. I don't trust anybody. All right, Cody, so I brought you a cheese stick as an appetizer. But just one? And, and there's a bite taken out of it. Yeah, so, um, there was four on the plate, but I really like cheese sticks. <sighs> well... If your mouth was on it, I guess I can have it. Mm. Julia, the order's ready! All right, Chef Baby. Oh my God, that looks so good! I know, I cooked the Alfredo perfectly! All right, Chef Baby, I'm gonna give it to Cody. All right, hurry up. All right, Cody, here's your Alfredo. Wow, Junior, this actually looks pretty good. Yeah, it looks delicious, so eat up. Uh, okay. Uh, um, J Junior, are you gonna watch me eat? Yeah, I have to watch you eat. I have to make sure you don't leave without paying like your parents did. But pay? Well, how much is this? Uh, like $20. Well, Junior, I don't have any money. You don't have any money? What? No, Junior, I didn't know this was a real restaurant. I thought we were just playing pretend. Cody, of course it's a real restaurant. We even have a menu. What? Yeah, written in crayon. Junior, I, I, I thought Chef PeePee was just cooking and we were just goofing. No, we're not goofing, Cody. We're trying to make money here. We're trying to start a business. Well, Junior, that doesn't make any sense. I eat here all the time for free. Yeah, but well, that's got to stop. We're trying to make it into a restaurant so we can get rich. Junior, you show me a business license and I'll show you a credit card, okay? Well, Cody, if, if Chef PeePee finds out you don't have money, he's going to get really mad. Uh... Oh, I see what's going on here. Oh, 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 is, isn't there any other way I could pay you? Any other way? No, Cody, just hurry up and get out of here before Chevy sees. He's gonna get really mad. All right, fine, but I'm taking this home with me. Uh, just hurry up and leave. Uh, uh hey, Chef PB, uh, Cody got his food to go because he, he had to go. Well, did he pay? Uh, yep, he sure did pay. He paid a lot of money in cash. Where's the money? Uh, he, he left it at the table. I'll get in a minute. Oh, okay. A another customer, Chef PB. Oh, man, we are in business today. <laughs> Thank you for coming to Bone Apple Titty. Um, I'm assuming you need a table for one since there's only one of you. Actually, I need a table for three, please. Uh, a table for three. Uh, sir, I can't seat you until your whole party's arrived. The whole party is here. It's me, myself, and I. Uh, uh, okay, um, I'll seat you now then. Great. All right, sir, here's the menu. I'd like to point out that the mac and cheese is burnt to a crisp tonight. It has the texture of a bowl of Fruit Loops. I'd also like to point out that the house favorite is the cheeseburgers above the steak. And also, the menu is made with a crayon. Crayola by me, so compliments are welcome. So what would you like to start off with drink tonight? We have a water bottle and bottled water. Um, I think I'll have a water. All right, our water coming right up. Here you go. <sighs> Why can't I just drink it out of the fucking bottle? Because here at Bone Apple Tea, we... Um, um, sorry about that, sure. I'm, right, I'm a big boy. I don't, I don't spill stuff that often, but uh, anyway, um, what would you like to eat tonight? Where are the prices at? 
Oh, um, uh, the price is, I, I think the cheeseburger is $5 and the, the steak is $10. Well, then I'll have a $10 steak. All right, how would you like that cooked? Well done. All right, so no pink? No pink. Unless you want my foot in your stink. Uh, very good, sir. Uh, it's coming right up. <sighs> oh my god, my restaurant is a hit! <laughs> hey, Chef Pee we got another order. <gasps> another customer? Oh man, we are on fire tonight! Okay, what do they want? Uh, he wanted a steak. A steak? The most expensive thing on the menu? Man, we are hitting it tonight! <laughs> uh, what, 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 how, how expensive? Like $10? Wait, $10? No! What the hell is wrong with you? It's an $80 steak! Uh, I told the guy $10 because there's no prices on the menu. Wait, wait, why is there no prices on the menu? Look, you better go and correct him, okay? Tell him it's $80, all right? Uh, if anybody wants my meat, they're gonna have to pay the price for it. Uh, okay, I'll, I'll let him know, Chef PP. All right, sir, your steak will be out momentarily. Momentarily. Uh, in a few minutes, your steak will be out in a few minutes. I'd also like to let you know that there was a price change on your steak. It is now $80 instead of $10. $80? You told me it was $10! I, I know, but due to the recent uh, alien invasion that just happened right now, they abducted a lot of cows. So now cows are really hard to find. And that's what your steak's made out of, is cows. It's gonna be a hell of a time for McDonald's. It, it didn't affect them because they already had their cows. We had to find a cow. So, so how does that justify an 800% increase from the original $10 price now to $80? Well, it's actually a seventy dollar increase, not eight hundred. Just bring me my steak. All right. And clean this mess up. Uh, well, the aliens abducted the napkins too, so don't, don't make me clean it up. Get the wiping. Oh. All right, Chef Pee Pee, is the steak ready? Yes, Junior, the steak is ready. That's how fast I cook. Um, he said no pink, and there's a lot of pink in there, Chef Pee Pee. Oh, he's gonna like the pink. Nobody eats a steak well done. Uh, uh okay, well. All right. Take uh, it to him. All right, sir. So here's your steak. Let me let me pick that up. Yeah, you do that. I am so sorry about that, sir. I thought you could catch. That's my fault for assuming. But if you need anything else, just give me a holler. Oh, hold on. I'm not eating this. Not after it was on the ground. Um, sir, we have a store policy. I have the five second rule in effect. So I have five seconds to pick up the food after it hits the ground. Oh, five second rule? Let me speak to your chef. Uh, okay. Chef Pee Pee, we got a whiner. Uh, a whiner? What do they want? Good man. Pee Pee? What are you doing here at my restaurant eating my food? Oh, I just wanted to come by and see how shitty it was. But so far, it's pretty fucking shitty. On a scale of one to shitty, it's pretty fucking shitty. You didn't even eat your steak! I didn't have to because it fell on the damn ground. Not to mention, I've counted at least six hairs on my steak. And when it came out on the plate, it was still mooing. Uh, it's not mooing because Cody's mom is nowhere near your plate. Oh, what do you want me to do about it, Goodman? I want you to make me another steak. Well, I, I can't make another steak. I can just recook that one. I don't want you to recook that one. I want you to throw this one away and make me a fresh, brand new one. Oh, my God. You, you know what, Junior? Just come on. Get a plate. But he's just trying to get free food. I, you know what? I got something for him. Come on. Uh, okay. All right, Junior, his steak is well done, just like he wants it. Uh, Chef B, ew, why is it all burnt? It's not mac and cheese. <sighs> he wants it like that. He said he wants it well done, so I cooked it as black as I can make it. Oh, oh, okay, Chef B, I'll give it to him. All right, sir, sorry for your inconvenience. Uh, here's your steak, well done. I didn't ask for a pair of smoker's lungs. Um, sir, you asked for your steak, well done. Yeah, I asked for a steak, not secondhand smoke. Um, would you like your bill? Uh, I'm not paying for this. Well, Chef Beebe, we got another runner. Uh, looks like we have to start charging white people before they eat too. Chef Beebe, he left without paying. Well, good riddance. I don't need good men's stupid money. Look, in a few months, we'll be millionaires and richer than he'll ever be. Look at that, another customer. You know what, I want to meet this one personally. Okay. Welcome to Bon Appetit, where we make you something good to eat. Bon Appetit, huh? Mm-hmm. Well, your sign says Bon Apple Teddy. Teddy, Junior, what the hell is wrong with you? I didn't know how to spell it. It's teat, teat, you idiot. Yeah, okay, it's great, but I got a call about an illegal business being run out of this house. Oh, there's nothing illegal going on here. The only dope being sold out of this house is some dope-ass food, or isn't that right, Junior? Yep, yep, some dope-ass food. Yep, yep. dope-ass food. Yep. Uh, yeah, do you have a business license? to sell this dope ass food? B business license? No, no, I didn't think I needed one. There's the illegal part. Wait, you, what? You, you need a business license to run a restaurant. Wait, no, I can't run one out of this house? Nope, and now it looks like you're coming with me. Wait, wait, no, no, no. Look, Junior, you better bail me out with the money we made, okay? We didn't make any money. But what about Cody? 
I lied. You um, bitch!